Hi there, Filthy Rich Productions. Um, this isn't going to be interesting to probably about, I don't know, 90% of people who view these videos. But, there's going to be a bunch that are actually pretty stoked about it. Uh, this is some vintage tackle. Um, American. So I'm going to show a, a few pieces here that I think are pretty sweet. They don't make them like this anymore. Uh, this one... I'm not sure who makes this, but it's uh, it's metal. It's like aluminum. That one's cool. This one's cool too. I don't know who makes that, but that's metal as well. Look how old this one is. Floater. Got a little spinny madoodle on the front and back. That's old. I guess I could clean it, it would look a little bit nicer. But I like leaving them the way they are. Here's an oldie. This almost feels like wood. I think it's wood. Uh, let's see if there's any names on it. No, nothing. If anybody who watches this knows what the names or any values of these things are, let me know. That one's pretty cool. Alright, what else we got? Got a bunch of these. Head and Tiny Torpedo. Got a handful of those. I'll show you the handful. Those are all head and tiny torpedoes. Probably a $200 lure in here. Okay, what else we got? Here's a popper. This one's in real good shape. Who makes it? Good quality though. It's a popper. Okay. Here's a, a skipjack. Oh shoot. The skipjack's in pretty good shape for the most part. Yes. Skipjack. That one's cool. Uh, let's see here. Here's a little baby one. That looks like another heading. Here's an F7. I don't know, F7 what? But that's a cool little hook setup they got going on there. Yes, sir. Uh, let's see. Tiny Crazy Crawler by Hedden. We got a handful of these, too. Little flaps come in and out. Boop, boop, boop. Let's see how many more I got. Yep, here's a couple more of those same ones. Okay, we got a few of these weird things. They're squashy. One, we got a frog like that. And, and then a green one. Looks like a squid. Those are cool. Ouch. Okay, what's this guy? Uh, I don't know who, who makes this one either. Like I said, if anyone knows who makes a certain one that I show, just mention it at a, whatever time you see it on the video. That one's cool. Good shape. This one's cool. Those little speckles are actually little 
confetti pieces almost just lacquered on. Very cool. What do we got here? It's another head head and wounded spook. That one's very cool. Look at that. The hardware. All stuck on there with like metal and that's quality. This little propeller. Okay. There's another popper. I think most of these are heading. Sparkles in the mouth. Little feathers going on to hide the hook in there. Now here's a strange one. Who makes this? This is called Hawaiian. With no other names on it. That's metal, it's solid. Might even be lead. Hawaiian number two, it says. Got the hook. Most of the little feathers have worn off. Okay, what else? Got a handful of these ones. Uh, jitterbugs. Probably by Hedden as well. Those are cool. And we've got hula poppers. Ouch. Hooks are still sharp. Hula popper. One of those. There's another hula popper. It's like, um, sort of feels like suede almost on the outside, but it's not. I know it's not. And what else? Another hula popper. This color. Very cool. Ouch, ouch. ouch. Okay, what are these things? Shit, dropped one. That little guy. I don't know who makes these ones either. There's another oldie. Come on, let go. That fish would have to be drunk to hit on something like this. I don't even know what the hell that is. No names, no nothing, but all metal hardware holding it together. Very nice. Uh, Pico Chico is the name of this one. Pico Chico. That's cool. And this one's metal too. It's called the Head and Sonic. Very heavy. Hooks are twice the size of the bait. And, uh, let's see. Here's another strange one. Oh, that's fucking windy. Ah, this one's wood. This one's gotta be worth something. I don't know what or who makes it, but it's wooden. Just painted eyes. All metal. You don't see construction like that anymore. All wood. Hand painted looks like too. There's this little weird one. That's just just like a bent up spoon. Cool. Okay. Oh, look, another wooden one. This one's nice. But it sort of had some color malfunction from rubbing it up against other uh, plastic tails or something. I don't know who makes that one either. So hopefully somebody knows something about, I don't know, a couple of these. Hope you found this interesting. Filthy Rich, over now. Oh wait. This isn't that cool, but 
I had the box signed when I met Italo Labigna. Italo Labigna, Canadian fisherman dude. Alright, that's it. Filthy Rich over now.